Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Omega. Welcome back to another Apex Legends video. So today I want to talk to you guys about Mirage because Mirage is a legend in Apex that I think a lot of people love just for his personality and just who he is, but I feel like not many people play him as much because Mirage is probably the weakest legend in Apex Legends right now. And that basically just comes down to his abilities. His abilities are very self-centered. They don't really help the team out a lot. They're mainly just for him kind of distracting enemies or trying to occasionally bamboozle them depending on who the enemy is because most people by now kind of understand you know if a mirage is actually real or not so mirage does need a few buffs i think to actually become better and to stack up with the rest of the legends and today i just want to talk about a few ideas that uh, i actually found from reddit on how we could make mirage better and i really feel like these ideas could make it into the game eventually because something has to be done about mirage it's been too long where he's been in this state and i think these ideas will really work so this actually came from a Reddit user known as Zeno the Boy. He calls it the Mirage Decoy Buff Smart Decoy 2.0. And this basically makes the decoys behave more realistic, more human-like. Because right now his decoys, you can very easily tell when it's a decoy and when it's him. They kind of have delayed, you know, sliding and they don't jump or do anything else. They, they just kind of like run in a straight line. It's so easy to detect when it's actually a decoy. Basically what the Smart Decoy 2.0 would do is it would allow the decoy to take race portals and it would also allow the decoy to climb up obstacles if you aim at a certain point above it. And personally, I think that's great. It just makes it more realistic because you want to make his decoy as close to like what a player would behave like as possible. Otherwise, it doesn't make sense to even have something like that in the game. It kind of seems like they're like one foot in, one foot out with Mirage. Like I think they need to go all the way and just make his decoys really powerful. Um, another idea that people had is that the decoys can now you know go on zip lines and balloons and i think that would be really cool but i still feel like there's kind of some aspect of the decoys that just don't really make them useful to the team and i was reading some of the comments on this reddit post and the one that i agree with the most probably right now is i think that the decoys need to take a little bit more damage before they disappear because in my opinion that is the only way that mirage's decoys will actually have real benefits to the team i can imagine if his decoys are able to you know get on zip lines and stuff you could send two decoys to the front of the uh the zip line and then you actually have kind of like a meat shield in front of you of decoys and that is a very smart way that respawn could change mirage in order to actually make him relevant because right now there's not a lot he does for the team besides you know if he can fake people out and get kills and you know you have to be a good you know gun player to actually be good with mirage also i really think they need to tweak his ultimate because right now when he uses his ultimate the decoys just kind of stand there in a circle like they don't do anything and it's really obvious that he just uses ultimate and he's probably going to reappear somewhere very soon so i think the decoys need to actually kind of like move apart and kind of do different animations they have to act like it would be him and then we could have some really cool out plays where mirage could you know pretend to be one of his decoys doing random movements and I think that would throw a lot of people off rather than just you know trying to guess oh is that a decoy is that mirage you know we need some more elements of movement from these decoys rather than them just kind of like running in the same direction looking super robotic like but anyways drop a comment down below if you guys like these ideas if any of you guys play mirage and you have any feedback on what you think should be changed about him or you know taken away or just made better in general make sure to leave a comment down below and I just want to ask you guys if you guys are new to the channel make sure you hit the subscribe button and uh, the post notification bell just so you guys never miss another video that I upload I'm trying to post at least every single day of Apex Legends news gameplay updates so I thank you guys all for all the support that you guys have given me it's been awesome but yeah I'll see you guys next time have a great day peace out